If you're experiencing connection or pairing problems between your Airtrim BT-105 and your iPad, or if it's just acting very sluggish, you may want to look at resetting your iPad's network settings. Now keep in mind, if you do this, this will clear out all passwords you have for your Wi-Fi network. So you'll need to have those passwords on hand and enter them again after you reboot your iPad. Anyway, let's go ahead and give this a try. We're going to go into settings on your iPad. Now there are two columns here. On the right hand side, we're in the general settings right now, and on the right hand side I can actually scroll down that column until I get to the bottom. And there's a button on the bottom that says reset. Tap on that. And then on the next window, you're going to see a button in the middle that says reset network settings. You tap on that, then tap on the reset button to confirm that you want to reset this, and then your iPad will reboot. Now again, keep in mind that you will need to re-enter any Wi-Fi passwords that you've had stored on your iPad to be able to access your Wi-Fi networks. The iPad, by its nature, will sometimes get overrun, particularly with the Bluetooth settings, with Wi-Fi settings. If you have a heavy user and you really haven't kind of cleaned out your iPad in a while, that can happen. I recommend actually resetting your network settings maybe once a month or so just to be safe but again if you're experiencing connection problems it chances are that the iPad itself has simply has its network buffer overrun and there you go we've just cleared our iPads network settings